travel with me to Indianapolis for a self-care weekend. So, I was booked to perform at the Girl Get Up Conference in Indianapolis. Lady Fee invited me to perform, so I was on my way, and I made it a self-care weekend. I booked my hotel, and I was ready to go. Girl Get Up Conference, I was ready. I was ready for some fun, y'all. But my first stop, I had to get these dogs together. So I went to the spa <laughs> and got a much needed pedicure because these dogs was roop, roop, roop. They was barking, y'all. <laughs> it felt so good. So I don't know about you, but when I get ready, I like to lay out all my options. I like to see everything that I brought, even though I have an idea of what I'm going to wear. And because I was booked for the pajama jam, I had to get unready to get ready to not go to bed, but to go to the pajama party. <laughs> so I was ready, y'all. Of course, I had to bring my pineapple purse, you know, pineapple accessories. So this is where the event was at the University of Indianapolis. This beautiful flyer. Look at Lady Fee. Aww. And it was just done with excellence. Everything was beautiful, inviting. I just was so impressed by the ambiance of it all. So here's Lady Fee entering with her girl, Get Up Ladies. They are all beautiful. They have on their pajamas. And they just kicked off the pajama jam right, you know. They got it hyped. Everybody was excited. And it just, it just was an air of just chilling and just gonna play some games and just really just have a good time like it was no like nobody looking at each other crazy you know how a room full of women it could be it could be intimidating you know but it was none of that it was just fun and uh lady fee she has such a sweet spirit so she got it kicked off it was a good vibe like i loved it and it <laughs> actually i was supposed to go to another booking after this downtown Indianapolis. I was supposed to do an open mic, but I ended up just staying there. I'm like, I'm just going to shut down the night here. This is such a vibe. Oh, and that was DJ Floetic over there. And um, it just was cool. It, it was, They had games. They had gift bags. We had food. And uh, this was karaoke. And Lady Feast team brought the energy. They brought the hype. I got to give it to them. They was... It was on another level, y'all. They they came to win, and they did. And I can't be mad. It was so much fun. So after this, I just left. I went to the Waffle House, and then went back to my hotel and just enjoyed my night. So the next day, I got up. As you can see, I'm leaving my hotel, and it's raining. I had so many plans to do some outdoor activities. One was to go to the Apple Orchard. And I was so upset, but, you know, sometimes you just gotta pivot. I'm gonna make the best out of this situation. And I'm, if you know me, I love the thrift, so I started looking for thrift stores. And lo and behold, y'all, I found a Goodwill outlet. And if you know, you know, like, go to TikTok and look up Goodwill outlets. Because they have these bins, they put them on the floor, you have so long to to um shop and then they change them out it's crazy like it's crazy energy in there because people just be grabbing up stuff but it was so much fun so all in all it was a good weekend i had so much fun and i just look forward to doing more of these self-care little retreats for myself and if you want to come along with me come along 